So this is Captain Sweep of the USS Penetrator, and I'm involved uh, with the Empire uh, from Carthage, and we are uh, close at war. It's been almost three months into this uh, region of the galaxy where we set up our colony, and uh, we've expanded quite a lot. And now we're at a position of almost total war with uh, Jabba the Hutt of this galaxy. And uh, let me just show you something, okay? So what we have here is here's the empire controls and under the colonies, all of these different planets are our colonies where you can see what we're uh, able to produce. So this is the home world, Noemi, and the third planet is Carthage. And currently, if you go down the map, there is a situation brewing where the Jabat's empire is bringing in a major fleet here to combat uh, the Azdat empire. And here they come in. So they've got battleships, battleships, battleships. They've got a pretty big fleet coming in, mostly battleships, no carriers. And then the Jabat's hierarchy has battleships, battleships, some destroyers, a supercarrier, battleship destroyer, battleship dreadnought. So a couple fleets coming in and on defense is the Azdid hierarchy who has 89 battleships. And I'm over here, I've got 154 ships. So I got carriers. I want these guys to command as I join the fleet. And so this is my main fleet. That's a carry with 20 ships. I've never been in battle. This is the first time near war. I've been building up a fleet just in case because right here, if you look right around to the lower right screen and the middle blue dots, uh, right there is the uh, Jabat's empire. Those guys with the hot dogs over here, see that's the Jabat's empire. They're way ahead of everybody in research points. I've got 8,000 research points. They had that like three, four weeks ago. If you, let's say go somewhere. I haven't been before you cl click the telescope. You hit the telescope. They don't know nothing about it. And now if you look at research points, the colonies are giving 2454 from the ships is 1301, from stations is 592, telescope studies, which that is a 694, meaning I've pressed that button 694 times, and planetary surveys, 3100. So all of those create your research points, and then your research points go into here, where there's physics, engineering, biology, philosophy, warfare, and materials. Right now, I'm researching molecular assembly and that's going to increase my production i think 50 percent of my construction even 50 percent. so this is huge it'll be done one year seven months and that's one basically two days in real time in this time in the game one day equals one year so there's been all these other researchers research fields that give certain advantages or percentages or something along the way uh, warfare, deep space warfare, advanced warfare, tactical cybernetics, cybernets, planetary batteries, zero gravity tactics, planet scale defenses, robotic warfare, military robots, orbital bombardment, physics at the beginning where you had the uh, 
Alcubierre drive, quantum drive, disjunction drive, fusion, any power, like all this is how your ships get propulsion. So your ships are in the designs. And if you want to create a ship, let's say a military ship, you've got corvettes, frigates, destroyers, light carriers, light cruisers, and battle cruisers, so heavy carriers. So let's say if you want to create a battleship, there's your battleship. And then it needs a propulsion system. Propulsion goes on the back. So you click on the propulsion, it's an anti-gravity drive. Click that. You add a component. Add a component. Max is four. I always like to put the max. And then you've got your uh, shields. So you're balancing your shields with your weapons. So you got your defense, you got an EMFL sheet, sheet, EMF shield generator or a point defense system. Point defense system shoots down missiles as it comes at you and a shield uh, shields you from the explosions. So let's just say you shield a lot. Put in five shields. And let's say we put in... Uh, two point defense systems. So this is a very heavily shielded vessel. <clears throat> and then on the outside of your weapons, and you've got fusion missiles, particle beams, neutron cannons, flux cannons. This is double damage to shields. So let's just say we Put a couple of flux cannons on and then we go back because the most powerful is probably the fusion missile send these missiles blow the crap out and maybe in the front you have a particle beam there just in case you're trying to zap some smaller ship so this i'm going to name Nice having a battleship name, eh? Save that. Let's just see what the message is saying. Oh, as uh, what's he saying? Defense pact. So I'm accepting the defense pact.
106 battleships, 11 battle cruisers, 34 heavy carriers, three light cruisers. A lot of mining ships out there. Mining ships is what brings in the materials. You've got uh, metal alloys, lanthanides, organic compounds, alkalis, alkalines. Anyway, that's the situation. Let you know later on what happened. 